Good cast iron frying pans should be in every home. Using it, you can roast a whole chicken, make a fruit crumble, fry eggs, or bake cornbread. To get the best results when cooking, cast iron pans allow you to cook at considerably higher temperatures than normal pans. You don't have to think twice about starting a dish on the stove and then putting it in the oven. Make sure to wear oven gloves when handling the pans because they can get very hot. When it comes to using cast iron pans, avoid the following mistakes and your pan will last a long time. Number 1. You're not using soap to clean your cast iron. This is by far the most serious, obnoxious, and common cast iron blunder I've seen. But here's the deal, your cast iron pan seasoning isn't merely a thin film of oil baked on. It's essentially a layer of polymerized oil, which is more analogous to plastic than grease in terms of chemistry. The seasoning is attached to the pan surface, and a few drops of dish soap will not be enough to remove it. Allowing hazardous bacteria from food to grow in your cast iron pan is not a good idea. It's fine to use soap, a soft sponge, and a little scrubbing. Scrubbing with a mild abrasive, such as coarse salt, and or a non-metal brush can also help remove burned on food. Number 2. Allowing it to stay wet. It's also important to note that cast iron should never be left to sit in water. You want to minimize the amount of time you have your pan covered in water. As soon as you're done cleaning cast iron pans, make sure they are completely dry to avoid rust spots forming on the pan surface. The pan can be coated with a small bit of oil after it's dried, but it's unnecessary. Number 3. Forgetting to preheat your pan before you start cooking. Cast iron is praised for its ability to heat up quickly and maintain that heat. For the same reason, you'll need to exercise some patience in order to get it there. Preheat your pan on the burner for a few minutes. Number 4. You're not maintaining the surface. After the pan has been heated and cooled, it is critical to coat the pan with oil in order to preserve the seasoning layer and keep the skillet non-stick. In order to keep the surface in good functioning order, it is necessary to perform regular maintenance. It's like moisturizing your skin to keep cast iron in top condition, the more fat you put on it, the better. Burning off the buildup on a pan surface can be a simple and effective method of restoring its original appearance, especially if you have a self-cleaning oven or grill at your disposal. Number 5. Buying a pan that isn't heavy enough. Authentic cast iron should be heavy, if it isn't, it's most likely a fake. Due to the fact that cast iron pans are formed by pouring molten iron between two sand molds, the handle should not be fastened into the pan but rather be attached invisibly. So, have you made a blunder with your pan? Please leave a comment.